I joined the 161 project just for more information as far as in what else there are other options to do. I've just seen an opportunity to get someone else's opinion and have a different perspective on growing cane. The success of RP161 is really around being able to tailor the recommendations and present them back to the growers so that they any doubts about what they're trying to do has been removed. So they can understand that the recommendations are suited, best practice for their particular farm, and then they're quite happy to move forward and, and put them into place. You know, I thought I was doing everything correctly, but um, with, with the 161 program, we've just um, refined the, my fertilising program a um, hell of a lot. And, um, and just, just have, the, you know, have the peace of mind in the back of your mind that you're, you're doing, I'm doing everything correctly to the best of our knowledge of the information that we've got at the moment. We can see a big difference in our property and the work that we do with Shay is leading to better, better crops, better CCS, good result all around. Every grower is different and so we work specifically with what those growers' needs are. Some growers have, need a lot more advice on one topic than others so we sort of try and tailor our on-farm advice and activities to suit that particular farming enterprise. So we focus on the runoff that's leaving farms and entering the reef. Obviously it's important for us to focus on what's going on on the farm and ensuring that what's being put on with the fertiliser rate is actually what the crop demands. The main specific change that we've made by being in the project is dropping nitrogen levels. So far it's been really good. We haven't had any problems that we've conceived by dropping nitrogen rates quite happy looking forward to what's going on, especially from a financial point of view as well as anything else. So as well as doing our on-farm work, we also like to run a few workshops. Um, one of the main points is to get growers together because growers learn a lot from talking to each other. The Google Earth trainings is useful as we give each grower um, a USB and on that's all their farm data. We put yield maps on there, locating of their soil samples, any EC mapping that they've done and also their actual nutrient management plan. Any of the um, workshops or programs or, or seminars or field trips they have. One of us try to get to. Even if you go to them and you only learn one thing, it's one thing you didn't know yesterday and it's one more thing you can put in to maintain and sustain a better crop, better farm. Working with pharmacists gives you uh, someone else who hasn't got a vested interest in selling your fertiliser and also is on your side as far as productivity goes. The project gives us confidence that our farm management is the best it can be. And that, as well as working through the BMP project, has given me the confidence that uh, my operation can withstand any scrutiny.